Your camera's firmware is software that controls things like autofocus and lens compatibility. I talk more about what firmware is and how to check if your camera needs a firmware update in this video. I also have a video on updating the firmware on your Nikon DSLR. In this video, I'll show you how to update the firmware on your Canon DSLR with my T4i, which is also called the 650D. Go to CanonUSA.com or whatever your country's Canon website is. There are multiple ways to find your camera. The easiest for me is to go to this search box in the upper right and type in my camera's name, T4i. I am then taken to a list where I can find the T4i's product page. From there, I go to drivers and software and pick my operating system from the pulldowns. Then I see the firmware version available, 1.0.4. Let's quickly check to see what version I have on my T4i. You can see here that I have version 1.0.1 on my camera now. Before we go back and get that update, we need to do one more thing. Format this memory card to ensure that it is blank. Formatting now, and done. Now I need to turn the camera off, take the memory card out of the camera, and put it into my computer. Now I'll download version 1.0.4 by clicking on it, agreeing to the terms, and it begins downloading. I can now open that file where I see two things. One is the actual update, and one is the procedure for updating in several languages. This is a good thing to look at before continuing. It has some good reminders for you. I've already taken a look at it, so I'm going to continue. Let's now get the firmware file from the computer to the memory card. Remember to put the file in the top level of the card, not into any of the folders. Now we need to put the card back into the camera. Before we can turn it on though, we need to do one thing, and that is put the camera into one of the modes within the creative zone. So you have manual, aperture priority, shutter priority, or program mode. I'm gonna put mine in program mode, and now I can turn it on. In the menus, I head to the fourth setup menu again, and to the firmware version item. Once highlighted, press the set button. Now the update screen comes up and we select OK to begin. Now we can select the firmware version we wish to update to and press the set button. Then we confirm the update from version 1.0.1 to 1.0.4 by highlighting OK and pressing the set button. Now we see that it is updating and that we are not to turn the camera off. Let's fast forward to the end. And we see that it's complete. We press the set button and we're done with the update. One last thing to do is to turn the camera off and remove the battery for at least two seconds. When the battery is reinserted back into the camera and the camera's turned back on, the firmware actually takes effect. Now I'm gonna go back and format the memory card again to get the update file off of it. And then I like to confirm that the version did actually apply. And then I'll be ready to start taking photos again. If you do run into trouble, like you get an error message or the update version doesn't appear, you can go back and redo the steps that I've talked about or contact Canon Customer Support Center and they'll be able to help you out.